next to the next. Okay. Yeah. So now that you've seen that, how would you make um, it go, instead of just going down one square, make it go down to this square down here? Uh, let's see. What was it? 40? Yeah. So it's so in the lower half. What? 120. So, uh, okay. So then, yeah. So where it says 40, you can change that to say 120. Oh, so um, starting where he is now, though. Or oh, starting... I see. Yeah, so, uh, so yeah, you can add 120 then, like this. Oh, I'm not sharing that screen. I'll go back to sharing that screen. Allow. So you can make it look like that. So uh, that would make it go forward another... So, cool. Yeah, how many total? Um, 200. No, no, 160. Let's see. One, two, three, Wait. four. Yeah. 40 times five. You can also, you can just try it out and see what happens. So you said... Uh, this is what you said initially. From from where it was, go another 120. Yeah. So, I think so. Go ahead and run it. Um. So uh -oh. first save. Uh, which is Command S, and then in the upper window, scroll down to the very bottom of the upper window, and then I guess you can just click on. Click on the text that says Python. Oh, you have to close the the window. The currently running window, and then you can just click on it. Oh no, that didn't work for me. I'll just type it again. Um, oh, I forgot to save. <laughs> uh, save and then. All right. So you have it now, you have 40 and then 120. And yeah, you could combine them and just do 40 plus 120, which is 160. 60. Yeah. Um, you can also express this as 40, uh, and then you can do math. So you can do times four. So this is how you say multiply by oh. something. Hello? Yeah. Oh. I heard you say ah, oh, and then I heard half of hello. Okay. Yeah. Uh, I don't know why, but you went out. Oh, uh, I would do it all in there. Okay. Forty. Yeah. Times four and parentheses. Control save. Enter. Nope. Uh, here. Enter. Yeah. So <gasps> save and then rerun oh, yeah. and. What? Um, I clicked there and pressed enter, and it said command not found. Oh, it looks like what it. It looks like it typed uh a little bit differently this time. Okay. Um, so instead of clicking on it, uh, click down at the very very bottom. Yeah. So now that your cursor is there, do. I think on a Mac it would be Option P. Hold down Option and tap P. And then hold down Option and tap P again. And then one more time. You should be going back through history. Uh, maybe one more so time. So do Option P and then Enter? No. Because uh, right now it's, it's still the wrong... Yeah, there we go. Okay, hit Enter now. Cool. Did it work? Whee! Yeah. <laughs> Okay, uh, so now that he's at the bottom, or she, now that the turtle is at the bottom, huh. it, um, what would you do next? What does, from the turtle's point of view, if you were the I turtle, I would say what would you angle, have to do? I forget, 90? So 
Yeah. So there's left angle and right angle. So it'd be so, left so, angle 90. Yeah. So that looks like left 90. Oops. 90. 90. There. Okay. And then what? And then I would go forward parenthesis 40 times 4. Okay. Then what? Um, Actually, let's just run that. So then I'd repeat. save and run. And then, oh, whoops! Did you? So you oh, have wow. to you have to close the old window. Does it look like this? Uh, nope. Wait, oh. let me do it again. So I think it's going to be easier if you. So I he just ran off the page and disappeared. He ran away. My oh. little guy ran away. <laughs> yeah. Do you see why? Uh, you have... Forward, left, 90, forward, 40. Oh, 40. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so... Your little guy ran away. Um... Oh, he's back. So, can I do? Can I put forward for? Can I put these in parentheses? Uh, Oops. yeah. Can uh, you say times four? Oh wait, yeah. Times Conceptually, one, yes, four. there is a way of doing that. Um, times three. We. So there's a few different ways that you might do that. So so there was a a thing mentioned the for loop. So let's do yeah. that. Um, let's do it that way. So four underscore in range. Uh, what did you say? Do it three times. One, two, three. Yeah. Okay. So that would look like. I this. can only see your turtle. Right. Okay. Hold on. Let me unshare and then share my Emacs. So. Um, that would look like this. So four underscore in range, and then however many times you want to do the stuff, and then the the stuff that you want to do needs to be indented. Um, oh yeah, there needs to be a colon at the end of this line as well. Yeah, and then if you also want to do the left 90, like whatever you want to do three times should be indented one level. Yeah. Uh, you can use a single space. Technically, that is valid, um, although most people would expect at least two spaces or a tab or four spaces. I think four spaces is the most common thing to do. Yeah, and that's what it that's what it's set up for uh, by default. Cool. So that'll make it do uh, three times what it already did. Yes. Okay. So let's save and then rerun. I think I don't currently have it open. Yeah, I don't currently have it open. So. Cool. Let me, I'm going to share that just for making it clear what actually happened. So we got, did you get a shape that looks like this? Yes. Okay, cool. Um, so then given that that's what happened, what would you do next? Oh, I think I see what's going on.
So you have the same thing, but times three. I wonder what would happen if I, yeah, I don't think there's a, a way for oh, me to, same. what happened? I it guess I'll, works, I'll... Except for the very, the very last one, I went one space too far. Okay. Wait. One, two, three, one, two. Oh, I should have just done two. Ah. So here is two. Okay. Uh oh, where did my window go? There we go. Oh, I didn't save. What the? Remembering to save is so hard. Let's try that. Alrighty. We're getting closer. All right. So does yours look like what I have, what I'm sharing? Yes. Cool. How do I you have the same code copy? as you. What? Can I copy this? Yes. You should be able to do okay. Command C. And Command then. Command C. And then Command V. Yeah. Oh, yeah. And then 40 times two. One, two, one, two. So you have that. So that looks like that. Yeah. Oh, did I not save? No, I did save. OK. Where did the picture go? There it is. Let's try that one more time. Make sure that it's definitely the right thing. OK. So that's what yours looks like? Yeah. Cool. Um, mm -hmm. So I think this one right here should actually still be 2. Even oh. though the very first time we went from 3 to 2, I think we still go 2. And then the turtle will go from here. So it went one, oh, and then yeah. two. And then, uh, but it's going two squares each time. So it went one, two squares, and then one, two squares. So if I make that change and save and rerun, Cool. So now what would you do? Oh. Cool. And range one, two again. So two is correct. Uh huh. So I'll just do 40 and then yeah. 40. Okay, and let's try running that. Save, rerun. Yay! Yay! Good job, turtle. <laughs> All right, good job, turtle. Can you, you can, can you put it. like pellets in the middle or a little fish? Oh, that's a cool idea. Uh, Aaron. Well, I guess it. But that would uh, that would make everybody want to finish that way. Then then they wouldn't have like because some people might want to go across down across down across down. Mm, yeah, I see. So like having a finish line isn't quite perfect. But this is beautiful. Yeah. Look at that little turtle. He did it. He did a spiral. Wow. <laughs> good for good for that little guy. Okay. Yeah. So, uh, that's it. 
Hooray. All right. Cool. Good job, uh, James. Do you think that you would be able to, like, right after we end this session, do you think you'd be able to make the turtle go again? Like, if I deleted everything that I wrote? Uh, no. If you keep the file, but just, like, close all the programs and reopen them, let's say. I would need help reopening them. Okay, cool. Um, I will, I'll put up the recording. It's going to be huge. Um, so maybe the recording will be enough. I don't think it will though. Cause I think there was like an issue with the recording where I had to stop and start. And I'm not sure if that was before or after the critical stuff. <laughs> um, I'm not sure. Uh, I guess we'll find out. Um, so hopefully that works. Um, but if you do try to do it and you're like, if you, you get stuck or something, feel free to um, ask. Like, send me a text message or something. Okay. Uh, or call cool. me. Yeah. Uh, and maybe Aaron, too? Yeah. All right. Thanks, okay. guys. Yeah. Thank you. Aaron, did you want to... Well, you said that pretend that you're a terrible teacher. So I guess that yep. was... That was that's what you wanted. <laughs> yep. To uh, do you have any like parting thoughts or anything? No. Good job. All right. <laughs> All right. Bye guys. Bye. Bye.